Adding a location to your Instagram post is a great way to get more local traffic. If you're a local business, this is a really valuable tool as you can connect with people in your local area and as people search for things to do in the area, they'll be able to see posts from you. The easiest way to add your location is when you're creating a new post. If I'm on Instagram, I can go ahead and click add, select the image, add any filters, which I don't want any, and then I can write my caption. I could tag people if there was anybody else who was involved with this post, or if I had somebody else who was collaborating with me, and then I can add my location. There's a lot of different things I can do. Right now I'm in Denver, Colorado, and I can see that there's a very broad all of Denver, Colorado that I could post, or I could do Rhino River North, which is a little more specific, or I could even select one specific business. I'm gonna go broad for this post, and that's it. Once I hit share, it'll add my location to the post and make it easier for other people in Denver to find my Instagram post. If you use an Instagram scheduler, or if you have posts that you forgot to add a location to, it's easy to add a location after you've already posted it. So let's say that this post right here, I'd like to add a location. I simply tap on the ellipses in the upper right hand corner and then go ahead and click on edit. Up at the top, I can see the option to add location. And for this one, I'm going to select Boulder, Colorado. And that's it. No. One of the great features of Instagram is being able to connect with other locals. For example, I can click on places and then I can see what other people are doing in my current location. If I type in the Eiffel Tower, I can see all the images people have taken here. Uh, for local businesses, this is a great feature because you can see what people are posting about your business or what sorts of posts are popular in your area. For example, if I do a search for downtown Boulder, I can see that right now the popular posts are all sort of summer fun. So I know that if I did a happy, fun summer post all about beating the heat, it would probably be pretty successful. Seeing these local posts also gives me a really good way to engage with people in my area. So for example, this super cute dog pic, if I hit like, I know that I've just connected with somebody who's in the downtown area. I recommend any small local business goes through and sees what's happening on Instagram in their area. It's a great way to see what sorts of posts are popular and it gives you an opportunity to connect with other people in your area. And if you're interested in more strategies to help your business grow, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I have great videos that come out every Tuesday. Until next time.